Start recording. All right, guys. So this is how you would place a strangle on uh, Think or Swim. Let me get my picture out of the way. Uh, see, did that move? Move it. Okay. I'm all up in the way everywhere. Here we go. Okay. <clears throat> all right. So to place this strangle on uh, Think or Swim. Obviously, I, I'm making an assumption you guys know how to get it to the option chain. So here, uh, select the May 17th, and then you have a couple of ways to do it. You can change it here um, to do strangle that way. I don't normally do that. Is that even showing up on the video feed? Hold on. It's not, okay, you can, yep, there it is, okay. So you can either select it this way, which I don't normally do, I rather manually enter these in. So go to the May expiration on Think or Swim, and then what did I do, the 8095s. Okay, so first uh, on the put side, just uh, go ahead, you should be able to hover over the bid and select it, and it should automatically Okay, bring it up here um, as a short on the put side. Okay, and then going over here, you're gonna wanna hold down control on your keyboard and then select the cell on the 95. And it should bring up both shorts over here. Okay, and then it should also bring up your mid price automatically and then uh, just hit confirm and send. And, you know, it'll give you your whole buying power, break evens, blah, 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 that you would need. Um, likewise, if you wanted to do this as a large iron condor, synthetic strangle, uh, continue holding down the control key and then click on the buy side, which is your ask, on the puts on the 70, okay? And then go back over to the calls and do the same thing. Hold down control, click on the ask bid, and now you have your iron condor. Um, this will give you your mid price, and then again, just confirm and send. Okay. So again, short the 80, and then you're gonna wanna short, hold down control, short the 90. The mid price, you know, it's a little bit higher right now, which is good. Confirm and send. And then this is going to fill automatically, I'm sure, because it's paper trade. No, it didn't. Look at that. And if it doesn't fill right away, you could do what I do. There it goes. Okay. Well, at least on Thinkorswim's paper side, it filled for me. Uh, but that's how you would do it on Thinkorswim. I think it was for James. James, any questions? Perfect. Anyone else got questions on Think or Swim placing this trade before I stop the recording? Good, okay.